Well, local scientists are both excited and concerned about this new species of whale they've discovered. It washed up on shore in the Everglades more than a year ago. And now Fox 13's Kimberly Cuisan reports that local scientists are hoping they can learn more from its remains before it's too late. Measuring 38 feet long and weighing 30 tons, this whale, discovered dead off Everglades National Park in 2019, is a one-of-a-kind discovery. It's pretty mind-boggling. Kind of goes to show us that we don't know as much as we always think we do. Originally identified as a Brutus whale, a necropsy was performed, and the whale was buried at Fort DeSoto Beach to allow for further study. After unearthing the whale's skull, Noah announced a remarkable discovery of a new species called the Rice's whale. Between the genetic work that's been done on the wild populations, as well as us being able to assist in recovering the specimen, uh, Dr. Roselle and her team were able to show that this is actually a brand new species. Gretchen Lovewell was part of the team with Moat Marine Lab that assisted in the recovery and necropsy. They're such an awe-inspiring animal, even, even in death. I think it's a really amazing opportunity to learn from them and try to help the others that are out there. A piece of three by two inch plastic was found inside the whale, which could have caused its death. In 2009, a similar whale washed ashore at Fort DeSoto. It had been hit by a ship. With fewer than 100 alive, scientists are working to learn as much as they can in hopes of saving the rhesus whale. I think it's a uh, pretty stark reminder of, you know, how careful we should be in the environment, making sure that, you know, stuff is getting disposed of the right way because, you know, there aren't very many of these animals out there. We don't want to contribute to more of their deaths. In Sarasota, Kimberly Quizon, Fox 13 News. Now, the Brutus whale can weigh up to 60,000 pounds, and scientists say their biggest threat is humans. They're concerned about boat strikes and also entanglement from fishing gear and ocean debris. You heard that one had a lot of plastic in its stomach, which is something we're hearing more and more these days. It